I start the stock off using my Barry M Cold Pencil in white and I sketch out the melted ice cream design on my face. Using my Snazaroo Classic Face Paint in the shade Fuchsia Pink and a Snazaroo Face Paint brush, I start to fill in the first layer of ice cream. I then change my brush and go into the Snazaroo Sparkle Face Paint in Sparkle White and fill in the second layer of ice cream. For the third layer, I use the Snazaroo Classic Face Paint in the shade Lilac. And for the fourth and final ice cream layer, I use the Snazaroo Classic Face Paint in the shade Turquoise. Also, all the brushes that I've been using so far are by Snazaroo as well. I now move on to my base makeup and apply some foundation on the areas of my face that I haven't filled in with face paint. To give this look a little more dimension, I create some shadowing around the layers of ice cream that I have painted on my face. To do this I use my Lunatic Cosmetics contour palette and I particularly use the brown shades in this palette. With the white face paint that I used earlier I put some swirls into the blue layer of ice cream. I then use the Fenty Beauty Vivid Eyeliner in the shade Wet T-shirt and I go over them swirls a little bit as well as line my lid. Using all the other shades of the Fenty eyeliners I go to the white layer of ice cream and create some sprinkles in there. To create the waffle cone neck I start off by going into the Snazaroo metallic face paint in copper and then into the Snazaroo classic face paint in light beige. I then move on to the shade dark brown to contour my jawline. Using the light beige face paint again I start to draw the lines of the waffle cone. I then create a shadowing using that dark brown face paint that we used earlier and I create some shading in the top corner of the diamonds. I then apply some mascara and then use the scouse lashes in the style and filled road. Our final step is the lips and I start off by lining them with a Primark lip liner in the shade Blush Melba. I then go over that with a liquid lipstick by Fleek Cosmetics and this is in the shade Pink Berry. Then to create an ombre lip I go on the outside with a liquid lipstick by Fleek Cosmetics again but this time it is in the shade Poppy Pink. To finish this look off I put my wig on as well as put this ice cream pop that I created on my head. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you liked it and I'll see you in the next one. I just need to...